Those dog days of summer keep dragging on. But the start of football season is just around the corner. What a great time for barbecue. In Texas, we love our football and we love our barbecue. They may not have been invented here, but we damn well think we do both better than anybody else. A good, good friend I have known since the sixth grade was in town for a few days and wanted to sample some Austin barbecue. I gave him a couple of choices and he selected La Barbecue. I'd eaten there a couple of years ago, Texas Passions episode 204, when they were still serving barbecue out of a food truck. La Barbecue has since moved into a brick and mortar location at 2027 East Cesar Chavez Street, a place they share with a quickie picky mart. I hadn't eaten there before, so we loaded into the minivan and headed downtown. We got there just after they opened at 11 a.m. I found a great parking spot right by the front door. The line was relatively short. It didn't stretch outside yet. It took about a half hour before we placed our orders. Then we found a couple of seats and dug in. Just as it was before, their brisket was phenomenal. Moist, tender, full of smoky flavor with a great outer bark. Fantastic. The pork ribs were big and meaty. The tender meat easily pulling from the bone when I bit into them. My friend said these were some of the best ribs he'd ever eaten. The pickles were homemade and very tasty. They had two kinds of barbecue sauce on the table. One was mustardy and sweet, the other with a bit more of a spicy kick to it. Neither sauce was needed, but each was real good. This was some really great barbecue. After we ate, my buddy and I wandered around the restaurant for a few minutes. They have a covered eating area facing Cesar Chavez Street and a larger shaded dining area to one side of the building. I didn't get a tour of their pits like I did a couple of years ago, but we did have a chance to briefly chat with one of their pit masters. In 2017, Texas Monthly named La Barbecue one of the top 50 joints in the state. Based on the outstanding barbecue my friend and I enjoyed, I gotta figure they'll be claiming another spot on that top 50 list the next time it's published. This barbecue is outstanding and rates two hook'ems. That's it for this episode of Texas Passions. Your feedback is very important to me. Any thoughts or questions you might have about this episode or my other videos, leave something in the comment section and I'll get back to you as quickly as I can. I'm always looking for new barbecue places to try. Maybe you've got a suggestion of a favorite place I should go to. Suggestions are always appreciated. If you like what you saw, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just click on my logo when it pops up and go from there. You can view previous episodes of Texas Passions by clicking on the links displayed. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time.